All right, here we go. Sprained my eyes. I I love that we're starting with this. The most ridiculous trailer for a show ever aired. I don't even know how this was real. It is so stupid. I can't believe it. This is the, (laughs) the, everybody has histrionic personality disorder, particularly on the left. And it really shows up in insane opening to shows like this one. Was Uh it a trailer or the opening to the show? Oh, I don't know. I thought it was a trailer. (laughs) Either way, it's the most amazing bit of television that I've ever seen. I can't even believe it's real and not parody. So just to give you a quick rundown of what happened in this, it's basically, I think it was from New, what was the? New Amsterdam. New Amsterdam is the show. show. And all of these people are getting news on their phone and they make it seem like it's 9-11. People are hugging and crying and they're looking at their phones. This guy drops his phone. (laughs) He dropped his phone. Someone drops their coffee. They're running towards each other. They ended up gathering in the hospital and then looking at this television. And then it says Roe v. Wade is overturned. (laughs) I mean, but I'm telling you, like the le- it was two minutes long. It's, it's the level you really think long. it's like the next 9/11. <laughs> like what has happened that is so appalling? Or like a mass shooting? Yeah, it's like Roe v. Wade is overturned. What killed me too is the men who looked at their daughters. I know, I know. <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> They like sadly looked at their young daughters <laughs> thinking about like what just like, how they couldn't they have couldn't abortions. Have abortion? Like what the fuck? <laughs> like that so was the gross. best part is like the dad looking at his little girl like she'll never be able to have an abortion. <laughs> <laughs> like, you're just going to have to carry the baby to term. Yes, you're going to have to carry that baby. Oh, God. It's so I weird. Mean, it's so sad. Stupid. It's so, it was so over the top. Of course, it got roundly mocked online, and we will be roundly mocking it on this show for the duration of the show. <laughs> I don't think people, when you look at the concern people have for Roe v. Wade, it's like seventh on the list of things that people care about. It doesn't even crack the list of the top five things that our Americans are concerned about. And it just shows you what a bubble the these people occupy. A big percentage of Americans are pro-life. Enough that you would be in a bubble to think that this would resonate with like the majority of your audience and they wouldn't just be laughing hysterically at how seriously you took this. It I is, couldn't believe it was real. I know. Uh, it's like a parody of, of itself. It's like a parody of Hollywood. Uh-huh. And what they how they view certain issues that most people I don't think take as seriously as oh Jesus as they do. It's just it's it was amazing. It gave me so much joy.